Little Naomi, Little Chick, written by Avirama Golan and illustrated by Raya Karas. Good morning. Little Naomi jumps out of bed. She gets ready for the day ahead. She brushes her teeth and washes her face, eats breakfast, then makes sure her school bag's in place. She gives Little Bear a hug. She kisses Mommy and gives Daddy's hand a tug. Little Naomi is ready to go, off to preschool with Daddy in tow, but not Little Chick. At school, Little Naomi meets all her friends, Sophia, Max, and Emma, Lily, Daniel, and Ella, Mrs. Kim, her teacher, greets them all with a big hello. Naomi puts her backpack away, says goodbye to Daddy, and goes to play. But not Little Chick. Naomi plays with blocks and builds a tower, feeds the dolls, and picks some flowers. She rolls around and jumps up and down. She bakes some mud pies and flops on the ground but not Little Chick. Story time. Naomi hears a story about a bunny who lost his tail and thought it was funny. Then she makes a picture with all of her paints, pink and green, yellow and blue, red and brown and purple too, but not Little Chick. The bell rings. It's time for lunch. Is this for me? No, it's for Naomi. Meatballs and rice, a tomato, one slice. A green pickle to crunch, sweet strawberries to munch. Naomi picks up her spoon and eats all by herself. She finishes her lunch without any help. But not Little Chick. Next, it's time to wash up and roll out the mats. Everyone gets ready for the afternoon nap. Soon all are sleeping, sound as can be. Lily, Sophia, Ella, and Max, Emma, Daniel, and Naomi. But not Little Chick. Who is the first to awake at midday? Naomi, of course. She runs out to play. And who is that walking along the way? It's Mommy, sweet Mommy. She's off work for the day. A hug, a kiss, another kiss. Naomi gets her backpack and says bye to her friends. She heads home with Mommy, walking hand in hand, but not Little Chick. On the way home, Mommy stops at the grocery store. She buys bread, cheese, and eggs, butter, and more. Naomi helps Mommy load the cart. She already knows the list by heart, but not Little Chick. At the playground, Naomi climbs and slides, swings and glides. Behind the trees, the sun is low, and Naomi knows it's time to go. But not Little Chick. Daddy's home, dinner time. Now what could that be? A fish called Naomi? No. A dolphin, a whale, a duck with a tail? No, no, no. Naomi is taking a bath with a splish and a splash. She washes her tummy and neck, her bottom and back. All clean. Daddy gets a fluffy towel to dry Naomi off. She puts on her bunny pajamas and gets into bed with a hop. But not little chick. Good night. Mommy sings two lullabies. Shh. It's late, now go to sleep. Naomi pulls the blanket tight. She is not alone tonight. Little Bear rests by her side. Naomi yawns and closes her eyes. And Little Chick? What about Little Chick? Yes, yes, Little Chick too snuggles in for the night. Shh, please don't make a peep. Little Chick is fast asleep. The end.